Welcome back. Now, if you've been living under a rock, well, you're gonna regret coming out. Cause I don't know if you heard, but there's a virus going around the world. Gyms are fucking closed and everybody's stuck at home. But lucky for you, I'm here to help you fight against the worst disease of them all. That's right, being small. Now, unless you're some sort of fucking weirdo with a full home gym, like a meathead doomsday prepper, then if you don't wanna lose your gains, you're gonna have to rely on scraping together home workouts. Now, there's no way around it. Home workouts fucking suck. It's like jerking off to your imagination. You're just going through the motions and you probably won't even finish. And then you just end up hating yourself. But thankfully, I'm here to help out. Not with the jerking you off. If you need help with that, hit up at Bradley Martin. Jerk off extraordinaire. Masturbating Merlin. Wizard of beating off. The fucking jizzard. Hand off the gay. Now today, Today we're hitting chest. We're gonna set the difficulty level to apocalypse and assume that you have no weight and no gym equipment whatsoever. And I'm gonna, oh, there we go. Yeah, that's good. And I'm gonna teach you how to titty fuck yourself while stuck in quarantine until you bust them chestnuts. Whatever that means, but it's gonna be sick. Get it? Sick? The virus? Too soon? It's never too soon to be serious about chest workouts and your health. Oh, wow, look at that. Fresh pick gnaw pump, straight from the vine. Now the first one, this is pretty obvious, push-ups. Push-ups are like a bench press flavored white claw. A watered down version that you need a shitload of to feel anything and you're already sick of them after two. But listen, I, in these times I will do literally anything to avoid being small and sober. So here's how to perform the push-up. First what you wanna do is you wanna get down on the ground like you're praying to Pekka. And then push the earth away from you like somebody trying to get you to open up emotionally. Now here's a little trick that not too many people know. You can actually do push-ups without posting it to your story and nominating me a hundred fucking times. Hey, here's an idea. Since you're already down here on your knees, I nominate you to suck my whole dick. Whole thing. Balls too. Tip to tame. Are you worried about getting coronavirus? <laughs> do you have crippling anxiety mixed with a fresh new dose of germophobia? Did you just touch anything? Well, then better get over the sink and wash your filthy disease bits until your knuckles bleed. Now, while washing your hands, use this time to get in some isometric chest squeezes. Now, what you're gonna wanna do here is you wanna really squeeze and hold it for at least 20 seconds and perform a minimum of 150 sets per day. Urgh. Clean and lean. Don't spot me. Wash me. Now the government has finally classified my hatred of people and it is now illegal for these peasants to touch me. It's called social distancing. So for a great chest workout, try physically pushing people away from you. Make sure to use explosive reps to push them a safe distance of a minimum six feet. And then now that you just touched a sicko, you're gonna want a superset with some isometric hand washing. Dylan, get away from me, Dad! <laughs> corona? More like Corona! No. Back up, peasant! <laughs> and now, a word from our sponsor. It's me again. One of the worst parts about being in quarantine is not having people around to prove you're more alpha than them. But I have the solution for you. Do you even lift the game? on DonMerch.com, a card game that scientifically proves who is the most alpha. Play it with your friends on FaceTime, challenge a stranger on chat roulette, or make it a drinking game. Every time you lose gains or life, drink. Every time you win gains or life, make somebody else drink. Pretty fucking easy. And also, since staying in is the name of the game, grab one of these, pull up, not out shirts. Be socially responsible. Stay in, DonMerch.com. Are you losing your mind being cooped up in quarantine? Is the darkness slowly taking over? Have you watched enough serial killer documentaries to become one? Do you also want a killer chest pump? 
Well, try squeezing your pillow and screaming into it. The endorphins, dips, barricading your door. Whether it's zombies, people after your toilet paper, or one of the 20 girls you've been sexting that thinks you're actually gonna date her when this is over. Whatever it is, you're gonna wanna protect your home from intruders. For a great chest workout, use your chest to push your furniture against the door for maximum protection. Tip, to really isolate your pecs, try not to use your legs at all. That should hold them. And lastly, for a chest fly variation, with a twist of alcoholism, stone colding, some cold boys. I ran out of Modelo, so all I got left is these pints of Guinness. These will have to do. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. New videos every week, I think this time, because I'm stuck here in quarantine and I got like, uh, I don't know, like five, five or six more of these home workout videos to make for you to watch. So enjoy that while it lasts. While you're sitting there doing nothing, maybe you do some online shopping. Go over to DonMerch.com, grab yourself some gear. Pull up, not out. Maybe this, uh, since we're doing a lot of drinking and nothing else, actually survival gear. It's a bottle opener and you can shotgun beers with it. Um, not, you can't use it as an actual bullet, so that's not gonna help you. Uh, it may be in an actual survival situation. Don't worry about that, though. You can get some gnaw pump if you're feeling like your energy's low and you need to just fucking cram it to the roof. Baby grow the shirts, obviously. Joggers, I don't know, just buy some shit. Go to